everyone welcome to another video on my channel today i am going to be showing you guys these new builder gel in a bottle by magpie and these are the build me up collection and if you're not familiar there are um, some other brands that have come out with kind of builder gels in a bottle type of style and magpie magpie has just come out with their version of a builder gel in a bottle and it is called build me up so today i am going to kind of look at the colors show you guys the colors and i am going to try and do a nail with a form on one of my nails using this collection so first of all just some information about the collection so it comes in five different colors so we have naked clear blush cloud and buff that's what i have here and some really cool things about these builder gels are you do not need a base coat so you do not have to apply a different base coat and then apply your builder gel the builder gel is its own base coat so that is pretty cool that kind of helps you skip a step and also they are hema free which is an ingredient found in a lot of nail products and some people can have allergies to HEMA so the Magpie products are HEMA free so if anybody has allergies to certain things you know you might want to give this a try or if you know you're already allergic to HEMA then these uh, would be a good option for you because they don't have that so you can extend these um, on top of forms or tips or you can just use them as an overlay over your natural nail and they are self-leveling they're 100 percent gel and they do soak off however you can fill them so the best thing to do would be to do a fill if you're using these products but they do soak off in acetone if you ever needed that and these are a 60 second cure these do retail for $19.95 on the website, uh, magpiebeautyusa.com. And some news that I just heard very recently was that they are going to be changing these from a bottle to a pot. Just because they are a thicker gel because you can use forms and stuff to extend the nails with and so some people were having trouble with getting the product at the very bottom once they did a couple of sets with this so they did decide to switch it from the bottle to the pot just to make it easier for everyone so from what i heard was that the magpiebeautyusa.com website is going to be getting the new potted gels in so for this stock with the bottle is they're going to be doing this special where if you order one you are going to get one free so if you order one just an example if you order one of the buff build me up and this is the older style in the bottle you will get one of the buff build me up for free until the stock of the bottled build me up is out and then they will have the pots so that is a really really good deal if you want to try these out and you could totally if it ever is a problem of trying to get the product out you can always buy pots online and you can kind of empty it into a pot if you'd rather use it out of a pot but the idea of having them in the bottle is, you know, it kind of saves you a step of getting out a brush and stuff like that. So, so I'm going to show you guys the colors and then I am going to do a nail with a form on myself and see how it works. So first we have clear, which is obviously a clear builder gel and it is very crystal clear. There's no cloudiness to it and you can see that it's pretty thick the consistency of this product then we have cloud which is a really milky creamy white which would be awesome for doing um, those milk bath nails because then you wouldn't have to be like applying a white color to the nail the nail itself would already be white and you could embed those dried flowers and it would be be pretty awesome to do those milk bath nails with so that's cloud then we have blush 
which is your cool toned pink. It looks like it's a little bit translucent, possibly. So this is blush again. This is the cool tone kind of pink color. We have Naked, which is more of your peachy kind of skin tone, nude pink. This one's really pretty. I might have to use this one on my nail. I'm usually a fan of kind of these types of colors. And last we have Buff, which is more of your darker pink and this one is looks to me like it's a little bit more opaque it's not quite as sheer so that one would be really really nice especially if you want like a full coverage you can see like how thick it is and again that one is buff okay so i have filed off my old product there might be a little bit of product in there and did really really basic cuticle work so just for this video so the cuticles might not be perfect but i um put on one of the magpie forms which are really really nice i've been using these on mm, a past couple surfaces if i needed an, a form and I highly recommend trying these if you are looking for new forms. The material of them is really like sturdy, I don't wanna say thick paper, but like very, very sturdy paper. It's not flimsy at all. And they have a really nice, nice opening for the fingertip to fit in. It's not too wide and it's not too slender. So I do really like these. I am liking these a lot. So I haven't put anything on. I've just cleansed and did really basic cuticle work. I think I'm going to go in with that naked color. So we don't need to do a base coat since it has the base coat built into it. The first layer I'm going to do is kind of thin and that is going to be like our base coat, but we don't need a separate base product. Okay, and I'm gonna cure that for 60 seconds. Okay, so I've cured that, and now I'm gonna go in with a slip layer and then a thicker layer over the top, and I'll kind of show you guys what I mean. And I'm gonna extend it also. I'm just gonna extend it just a tiny bit just to kind of see how it feels, like if it feels strong kind of hard to try and do it in the camera. <laughs> so if you get good with application with this, you definitely don't need to file it. Like you could just get really good at making it pretty smooth and then you wouldn't need to file it before you're gonna put color on. Also Magpie does, if you are familiar with the Magpie products, they do have another gel called Give Me Strength, which is a little bit stronger than a gel polish. However, the Build Me Up is stronger than the Give Me Strength, and the Give Me Strength does need a base coat. It does not have a base coat built in. So that's just kind of a little bit of the differences between the two. So you have like your basic gel polish, and then you have the Give Me Strength as like the next level up of strength, and then Build Me Up is stronger than the Give Me Strength. So that is kind of what I have going on there. It's not perfect. It definitely takes a little bit of practice to kind of get the hang of um, working with it and making it smooth, but it's pretty dang good. And if your clients want the color that the gel comes in, like imagine how fast that surface is gonna be because you're not going to need to apply another layer of gel polish to add like a color on top of it. It already is the color that they want. So you just apply top coat and go. So I'm gonna cure this again for 60 seconds and I'll let you guys know if it gets hot in the lamp at all. It probably will, I imagine, because my lamps are pretty strong. Okay, here's what the nail looks like, all cleansed and with the form off. The gel did get hot in my lamp. However, my lamps, I have the Accents hybrid pro lamps and they have a really really strong cure so pretty much every single gel gets hot in my lamp um 
So I did feel a little bit of a heat spike, but I always, when I cure, I always put my hand in and then pull it out after a couple seconds and kind of go back and forth a little bit. So that is what it looks like after, um, yeah. So it does feel pretty dang strong, I will say. So I'm gonna file this into shape a little bit better. Eat pretty easy to file, just like most gels. All right, here's the finished product. I just need to apply top coat. And it filed really, really easily. It definitely feels strong. You can see my natural nail ends like right about there. And then this up here is the extension. And it feels really, really strong, I have to say. I love this color. This is, again, this is the color Naked. I'm gonna apply the Magpie Don't Be Tacky Top Coat on top. And then I'm gonna cure that for 60 seconds and then it should be good to go. All right, so here is the finished product. I didn't put any cuticle oil on yet, but it looks pretty dang nice. And that was really, really easy to do. I really like it. And you could totally put whatever color you wanted on top of that. Like you would not have to just leave it the color it is. You could definitely put color and art and do whatever you wanna do on the top. But I really like that. That was really, really easy and it feels really strong and it looks really nice. I really like that color. Okay guys, so I am definitely gonna have to try these out more on my clients. So far, I really like it. It looks really, really nice on the nail and it feels really strong and it's really pretty and easy, easy, super easy to do and you don't need a base coat, oh my gosh. So I am definitely gonna have to try these out on some of my clients and kind of see how they wear and I'll see how this one nail does. But like I said, you can purchase on magpiebeautyusa.com and they ship to anywhere in the US and Canada. And also follow me on social media because if I ever have a coupon code or something like that, I will post it on my social media so you guys will know. And it's under the same name, at Nails by Katie Dutra. And thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if this is something that you want to try out. And please give this video a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.